today's video, we'll show you two creative transitions that you can use in your videos to improve the appeal. If you're interested in this one, keep watching. Open VidiPro Vlogger. Import the two clips we lead. First, put a first video clip into video track. Adjust the timeline to the right length. Drag the playhead. Find a suitable position to create a transition effect. Use split to crop the video from here. Click this button to take a screenshot of this frame. Then re-import the screenshot into VDP Vlogger and import it into the place where you do the split. Delete the rest of the video clip. Next, import a paper folding image. Well, you can download it from the link we put in the description box down below and place it on the overlay track below the frame. Resize the image so that it covers the entire screen. Then, we find a blend mode. Adjust the multiply, or the burn. Then, adjust the opacity based on the image effect. Then, we take a screenshot of the frame again. Same as before, import it into video Vlogger again. And put it into video track. Delete the clip on the overlay track. Then, import a second clip and adjust the length of it. Find transition. Add a fade effect here. And add a page turn effect here at the back. Finally, adjust the duration of the two transition to right length. Add a sound effect. Now, a paper photo transition is complete. To make a burning transition, we need to import two video clips. Put the first clip into the video track. Next, we need to use a burning clip. You can download it from the link in the comment sections down below. Drag it to the overlay track. Adjust the length of the video footage based on the burning footage to make them both the same length. Next, drag the playhead to find the moment when the green screen remains intact. Then, in the preview window, scale and move the footage. Make the green color cover the whole screen. Then, drag the playhead to find the moment where the flames appears. Use chroma key to remove the green part. Here, you might need to carefully adjust the tolerance and smoothness values to keep the flames intact. Play and check the effect. If there is no problem, click Export and export the video. Next, import the video you just exported into VidiPro Vlogger again. Delete all the footage from the timeline. Then place the video you just imported on the overlay track. Let it fade your screen. Then put a second clip on the video track. Drag the playhead to find the position where the blue screen appears. Use chroma key again to remove the blue screen. Again, adjust the tolerance and smoothness values so that the flames remains. Finally, add a sound effect. And now, a burning transition is complete. Well, this is all for today's video. And if you want to know more about other end tricks or what has been going on with VidiPro Vlogger, be sure to click that subscribe button to subscribe channel if you haven't yet. And we will see you soon in the next video. Hope you enjoy. Bye bye.